Hi, this is Shiv Ranika. I don't know what to say about Shanty Town. It's, it was so violent. It was such a horrific rendition of a way any kind of human beings can live. And yet, when I go online and I look at the comments and people are saying, Oh my God, I'm so proud. And they were using um, their particular dialect. Yeah, they were using some sort of language and the thing about it is that when they spoke that particular language all you could all you could see was the deep part of the mouth and the tongue and you see the snarl and it was not a good language to hear to your ear it was not good and I think I'm traumatized (laughs) by watching that uh, short series and it made sense, but it didn't make sense. Some of it is probably true, but it was horrific from beginning to end. And the guy who was the main star, his name was Scar. Let's call him Scar from the movie. When you, you know, like when there's an actor and then you go to the IMBD page to look for the actor. He looks all suave and he looks all cleaned up and he looks all, you know, different. You kind of, people kind of look different in their photos. They're, you know, paid for photos, part of their resume. They look so different than a horrific scene that they played throughout a whole movie. He was a scar throughout the whole movie. Okay. His name is well deserved. And when you look at him, he doesn't look any different. He's a scary looking guy, even with his best pictures and the shirt and suit and tie and, you know, no scar, no blood, no nothing. He still looks like a scary dude. So I'm traumatized. I, I am traumatized after looking at this particular series. And uh, whereas people are saying, oh, it was so good good and you know it was it was really a good rendition and, and and kudos and the acting was so good i'm i'm traumatized i think i've forgotten that maybe 80 percent of what i saw because that's what my mind does it will put things in the con in the compartment and i seem to not want to remember it he was a scar scar was a scar and to think that people like him do exist and they, they they want to put themselves in positions of power and they want to control people. I think what happened to him in the end was not justice. It was too it was too clean. It was too sterile. What happened to Scar? At the end of the movie I I, I if I were to direct that movie it would have ended differently. I, I, you know, you would make sure that someone like him did not survive and could not survive and there was no possibility of him breathing. So do I, what do I say? What? Where do I go with this movie, with this series? Uh, I, I, I guess, I guess I should give it like a four because because they're people and they did their artists and you you should give it some credence and I should give it a four maybe even a five maybe even a five I should give this particular series but um I'm traumatized by it I I I have a fear I have a fear of situations and you know shanty tongue shanty town to think that anything like that exists on the earth makes it quite clear that this is a hell we find ourselves in here we find ourselves in hell and we do all we can do to make it um, bearable you know the malls and a nice car and live in a big house and wearing nice clothing even in shanty town they had 
wigs where did they get the wigs from those women who, who had on wigs galore wigs 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 and you know so even even in the worst of situations people try to cover everything up and try to they try to survive it they try to survive bad situations scar was a scar to the earth scar was a scar to the universe scar was a scar a scar to any god that can imagine creating something like that this is hell ladies and gentlemen ladies and gentlemen we live in a hell and shanty town was there as a testament this is sherry veronica